Hello everyone, uh, I'm missionary Yun and Sun. It is the Medit mission to walk with God on September 6, 2020. Today's text is Acts chapter 24, verses 24 to 27. Today we I have one medit um, testimony about our uh, new house in Korea. We transferred the house here, but we found that the house itself is old, but it is okay. But the outside, the one late, old lady uh, deposed uh, the boxes and then all the trashes around the building. So the smell or the bugs, but anyway, it is not clean environment. So, the house also very old and then we transfer here and then clean the house and then as we clean the house we ask god lord what do you want us to do here and then god give, give us the heart to replace the the sink in the kitchen for next missionary. So we decided to donate the budget to change the sink. And then as we change, as we decide like that, we are thinking, yes, many times we do not understand God. However, by experience, we learn that obedience to God's will is the best for us. So we do not know why God gave us the heart to donation, but because he gave us the heart, we decide to obey. Because we believe that God is always good and God is always right. That is what uh, I experienced today. And then today text is, Acts chapter 24, verses 24 to 27. After some days, Felix came with his wife, Drusilla, who was a Jewish, and he sent for Paul and heard him speak about faith in Christ Jesus. And as he reasoned about righteousness and self-control and the coming judgment, Felix was alarmed and said, go away for the present. When I get an opportunity, I will summon you. At the same time, he hoped the money would be given him by Paul. So he sent for him often and conversed with him. When two years had elapsed, Felix was successed by Paulus Festus. And desiring to do Jewish a favor, Felix left Paul in prison. So here we can see the man Felix. He has the power to release or keep Paul in prison. However, we can see that he loved money. You know, when Paul preached the gospel, he did not want, uh, he hoped to get the money from Paul. That's why he called him many times. But whenever he called the, the Paul, Paul just preached the gospel to the Felix. So from this text, we want to reflect if we are like the Felix, how about our heart? Though we believe in Jesus Christ, sometimes we just follow the man. But the Bible says like this, Luke chapter 16, verse 13, no servant can serve two masters, for either he will hate the one and love the other, or he will be devoted to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and money. So here, I definitely point out that we cannot serve both God and money. So our choice should be God, but in reality, Many times we admit that we tend to choose money. But the 
Bible says also Revelation chapter 3 verse 16 also, so because you are lukewarm and neither hot nor cold I will spit you out of my mouth so when we are we do not choose God we are between God and money we are like a lukewarm right and God doesn't want of that so Felix heard the gospel, but he chose the word, especially money, not repentance. When we listen to the gospel, we have a two choice, reject or accept, right? So if we accept the, the word of the gospel, we do repent and accept Jesus Christ as our savior. But also there are many people who reject the gospel, okay? In the case of the Felix, he chose money. The consequence of his choice is hell because there is only one way of our salvation accepting jesus christ as a savior if we do not accept him as our savior the other option is hell not the kingdom of god so let us reflect our yesterday if we were same with the phallics though we become christian so though we become a Christian, we are between money and God. Not hot, not cold, but lukewarm. But God does not want that then. So we Christian cannot be free from failure because we are just a human. We cannot be perfect like our God. However, we should do our best to be like Christ-like. So today is more important than yesterday. If we were like Felix until yesterday, we can resolve today to be Christ-like Christians today by depending on the Holy Spirit. So I encourage you, all of us should love God more than money. And then if we were like Felix yesterday, God gave us today by his grace so we can do it today let us be like christ thank you